Hey YouTube family, this is Jennifer and we are here today to do a, another video on Wilton Candy Melts. It's the Candy Melting Pot Set. Um, we have the dual silicone drum here, which has already been preheated. And our strawberries have been rinsed and they're drying now. Um, we will momentarily be putting in one of the Wilton uh, Candy Melts. So we are doing both a Wilton's candy melts inside of the candy melting pot set. And we are gonna be using um, coconut oil for um, the morsels if we need to thin them out just a little bit more. Um, we have some rainbow sprinkles. Of course, we're gonna use our little cups. I'm gonna use these to pierce my strawberries at the top so that I can dip those. We will use, we're gonna use wax paper, but you could use um, just parchment paper as well. Um, and then we are going to do pretzel rods. We have some giant marshmallows, double stuff Oreo cookies, which I didn't intentionally mean to get double stuff. And then these are the golden um, Oreos as well. And of course we have our spoons so that we can stir as needed. And so with no further ado, let's get it started. Everything's been prepped and cleaned. We even have our um, little dishes or display dishes that we're going to use as well. Be back. So guys, if this is your first time coming to my channel, welcome, I thank you. Hopefully this information will be enlightening for you. This is only my second time using um, the candy melt uh, melting pot. I did a video a few months ago, you should check it out, where um, we did some cookies or just some chocolate molds, I believe, in a silicone um, container. So, we're gonna let our um strawberries continue to dry i put some paper towel over those so they can dry and we're going to go ahead and get started with putting some morsels in here i've already opened up the bag and we're going to start by putting just some slowly in here just a few at a time we're going to do since it should be preheated chocolate and um, bright white dark cocoa is what this is actually okay. and so um we're gonna let this melt and we will be back This is just literally a minute or two after putting it in there. So we're gonna put some more morsels in here so they can continue to melt. We'll be back. I don't want my stuff to harden, so I'm going to try to be quick, but Take our strawberries that we've already pulled up. We'll get as far down as we can get. And let this drip down. And I really was going to use those picks. That's what I said I was going to do.
So with these strawberries, I said I, I needed to hurry up. This wasn't my plan to do it like this, but I needed to hurry up because uh, my chocolate is starting to harden and it's doing something funky. But like I said, this is only my second time using this and there were a few strawberries that I opted not to use because during the uh, refrigeration period, got a little too cold. And so this one is not acceptable. This too, like, too kind of mushy. So I wouldn't put no chocolate on that. Because those are the ones I hate. Like this, it's, it's already sweating the, the, the juices. So, so there were three. So we ended up with only 13. But we're going to proceed, even though I feel like something ain't right. We're going to keep it moving. Let's see what our final results will be. I do apologize. I don't have a cold. I'm just uh, having these effects from my sinuses. You were drainage trying to anyway. But we're not going to let that happen. And guys, I think my, my cocoa chocolate, it might be done. I don't know if I can say that because I took it out. Um, trying to do something I probably shouldn't have just, I should have just tried to do it from the inside. <laughs> but seeing as though it's too late for that, I was still. Oh, I'm tripping. I thought. Look. I thought I was in trouble. Okay. We back in the game. Let's see. First off, let's take this spoon. Let's stir this properly because the glass is supposed to keep the chocolate cool. You know I meant warm. Because, <laughs> you know, heat. So, okay, it, it's good. Maybe I can go a little further down. Always trying to think of ways to do it efficiently, but quick. Trying to cheat. Now, I did put some cocoa, excuse me, coconut oil in here because I saw what was about to happen. So I called myself heading it off, which uh, apparently it worked. So, because this is back, this is uh, consistent. Then I'm gonna 
drizzle. I have a few more strawberries. I think I'm gonna have to put some cocoa a little bit. Just it just takes that cocoa in the uh, in this bright white. I want to try a drizzle. I really don't have what I need for the drizzle, but we we gonna make make this work. Watch. Now, some things I'm actually interested to see what will happen with, like with the strawberries. I know if it, they were, they were dry, but if there's any water, soluble water in there, I think it's going to make the chocolate sweat, but we'll see. I'm almost done with the pretzels. I just have a couple more strawberries and then i want to try this drizzle and then i think we'll leave the um oreo cookies and the marshmallows for another day another video and i guess guys it can be a little messy but we're gonna work with what we have we're about to get rid of these gloves. They slowing the sister down. And then you can also use toothpicks, of course. You want to use toothpicks. And you see, I... I find a way to always... Oh, <laughs> to improvise. <laughs> These are corn on the cob uh, holders. <laughs> so, you gotta be creative. Especially because I didn't have any toothpicks. Okay, so I might need to... It's getting a little thick, I think, so... It's all warmer. Uh, I don't know. Okay, watch this though. So anxious to put something in there, huh? Let's see. We have a couple more strawberries, and I think I want to do make these.
These are bad strawberries. We're not gonna use them. Cause they are sweet. Mm. Okay. So, I wanna try to do a drizzle. Cause otherwise we, we were successful, but let's just try to do something real quick and see how this works. Let's watch this. Let's both thin this out. And then I'm just gonna take it and drizzle it over these pretzels. The strawberries actually are White, but you know what? I could actually do it over them too. Loosen it up just a little bit more. All right, guys. This is the masterpiece. But let's see. I only ended up doing seven pretzel sticks and two, four, six, eight, ten, thirteen of the. Uh, but I don't think this not even. This not gonna stay. We won't even worry about these this time. We next time we're gonna get some glitter, and we'll do it. And so, uh, yeah, this is the outcome, and I'm gonna have my son taste them. Take all this stuff out, and I'll present them in a moment. But not too bad. First time, guys, doing the pretzels and the uh, strawberries. So, can't do nothing but get better, right? I'll be back. Uh-uh.
Uh-uh. That was our last one I bought there. But these now must go in the refrigerator so that they can seal. And then we're going to eat them. Yes, yes. And it didn't take that long, guys, did it? Didn't take that long. And I will say that I will likely do this again. That's cool. And here we are. Hope you guys liked it. Um, please comment, subscribe, like, and share. Until next time, be creative, try new things, jump out there. It's your girl, Jennifer. Until next time.